and welcome back to echo rp so in the previous episode we ended up doing quite a bit but mainly of course getting this nice apartment getting our bike and of course we started a little grow up in our bathroom uh now yesterday oh we planted these actually two days ago yesterday i went on and i fertilized them again and i watered them again and now today we are back once again and i've already watered again this one so this one is ready to go but if we go back here and we check out one of the ones behind it we can see growth 93 percent needs water so if we give it the water it should finish the rest of the process there we go so let's actually grab our first plant make sure our inventory is good yeah we have plenty of space and let's see what we get so pick plant uh whoop your plant has finished growing pick it up before it goes bad let's do that picking okay pretty fast and there we go we got 13 phoenix flowers okay um first of all can we do anything if we just hit use yes we can so with two of the bud and one of the rolling papers we can make a phoenix joint interesting and i'm guessing maybe we can use it for other stuff as well let's pick the next plant again i think we got what 16 from the last one so 14 no no we didn't we got we got 13 from the last one 14 from that one i believe and let's see how much we get from this one again let's add the water and that should finish up and then okay this one's not ready yet this one's at 98 percent so that should finish near the end of this episode or at some point in this episode we ended up with 27 phoenix flowers now what i want to try out is i did see something over at the electronics store for, so for now let's store the phoenix flowers up in here again let's make sure that thing is always locked when we're not home and what we're gonna do is head over to the electronics store and i believe i saw a high quality scale maybe we can turn them into baggies as well and sell them but i'm not 100 sure if that's even a thing here but uh, either way let's go grab our bike and we're gonna head to the electronics store see if we can pick up a uh, high quality scale and then maybe see what we can use it for either way let's grab our gargoyle or wait why can we not grab our gargoyle here this is a little weird wait vehicle list gargoyle track uh, for some reason, we can't take out our gargoyle. Five minutes later. We go to our vehicles. Okay, public garage E. Is that not here? Okay, so it actually parks it per garage. Okay, that's interesting. So if we park it here, or if we park it at one garage, we have to take it out there. And I freaking parked. <laughs> I parked it up in Polito. <laughs> oh, I forgot I parked it there last night. Well... Oh, wow, this sucks. Oh, I guess we're gonna... Yeah, I gotta go get my bike from Polito. I'll see you guys once we're freaking up there. And we're finally up here in Polito. I can't believe we left our freaking bike all the way up here. Definitely was not the most convenient thing. So we should be able to now... There we go. Okay, so now we can grab our bike. Perfect. All right, so while we're up here... Is there an electronics store or do we have to go? There is a tool shop, which I don't think sells the same stuff. So I think we're gonna have to go all the way back into town. Well, the one I remember seeing it at was near Legion Square, I believe. I think it was this one where I saw the high quality scale. I think it was, it was either here or it was at the Mega Mall. Uh, either way, let's, oh boy. Oh boy, we gotta head all the way back down. Let's head all the way back down into town and uh, hopefully go to the electronics store, grab a scale, and see if maybe we can do something else with the bud we recently picked. Hopefully we can. I will see you guys once we made the whole long journey down from Polito. Alrighty, and we're over at, I believe this is the guy we need to talk to and electronics store and then does he sell the okay so he does sell the high quality scale so let's buy one of those we might need cash for it i'm guessing yeah i think we need to grab some cash so we need about another 300 bucks let me go grab that real quick and come back all righty so i grabbed a little bit more money and now we should be able to buy the high quality scale now i did want to double check uh just in case actually i think do we have any plastic i think we can craft it so ziploc bags maybe we need these to actually do more so let me see if i craft the ziploc bags i use the ziploc bags nothing happens what if we use them while we have the butt on us though that might work maybe with the scale let's uh let's quickly go to a general store as well because possibly there's like baggies or other things we might need might as well just check real fast we can need to pick up some rolling papers anyways just in case the rest of this stuff doesn't work so uh, let's also head to the store real fast 
and let's see what we can buy if i can check the shop correctly so uh ziploc bag so we just crafted some of those i'm gonna grab like another five just so we have them and then i think that's it it doesn't look like there's anything else the rolling papers which we'll grab two of we can probably grab a couple more but we're gonna need some grab some more cash out and we just bought two notepads by accident not not the best play let's grab a little bit more money and uh, buy a couple rolling papers as well all right so again let's not mess it up this time let's grab let's say five rolling papers again still a little weird with the system uh, actually let's grab another five why not let's grab 10 of them and then i think that should be it i don't think anything else here would help us uh we'll grab another five bags we'll probably need them at some point i'm guessing and i think we should be good let's head back to the apartment and see what we can craft of all of these new supplies and we are back home finally once again let's head on in and let's grab some of the stuff that we had gotten earlier some of that flour real quick uh let's just grab 10 of it just to test some stuff out with and let's see if we use this high quality scale nothing happens what if we use the phoenix flower nope trying to wait the the high quality scale says does absolutely nothing um i'm hoping that it's just there as like flavor text uh because i would assume it actually does something else i don't know why it would be in the shop what about if we use the ziploc bag now that we have the scale nothing uh if we use the rolling paper it'll just bring up okay nothing for that either so I guess maybe the order we do it in matters. So Ziploc bag again does nothing. High quality scale does actually nothing. And then these don't do anything. So the only way that we've been able to do anything so far has been with the uh, actual bud itself to make the joints. But we can't sell these, I don't think, to anyone. Um, we also did get a Pineapple Express one, which... I don't know how we got this. I think when we harvested the Phoenix ones, we somehow got one of the ones for Pineapple Express. Let's also see if this plant's ready. By now, it should be. Nope, still 98%. I'm guessing it should be ready, honestly, any time now. Um, but we also have that one, which we could actually plant up now. We're going to have to buy some more fertilizer at some point, though. But we'll plant this one up as well in our little bathroom. And now that we also know how the actual growing process works, we will uh, probably grow the rest of our other ones as well. We're going to need to grab some more fertilizer, though, from the store. Uh, but for now, let's just get this one going, at least. We need a plant fertilizer. There we go. And then we should just be able to fertilize this real quick. Boom. And then we should be able to water it. Boom. And then it should be good for, again, the next 12 hours, I believe. There we go. Perfect. So there we go. Got that set up and yeah i don't know exactly if the high quality scale is actually does nothing i don't know why they would keep it in the shop if it actually has no purpose but maybe we are just using it wrong that's what i'm guessing uh what happens if we i guess the use the joint will just actually have a smoke it i think yeah i really don't know what else it could be used for i guess well, whoops i guess we will find out at some point but i guess let's pull this stuff away for now um we'll probably turn this into joints at some point but for now we can just keep it in our inventory drop all the rest of this stuff off i still have to organize all of this stuff eventually but what i think we're gonna do now is we're gonna continue with our car chopping from the other night i think or from the other day or whenever we did do it uh again we don't have anything on us that we don't need at the moment we're actually going to smoke one of these and see what they do obviously we don't really have much stress but i do want to see if it gives you armor because i'm guessing it does okay so stress relief which is what we want and we got a little bit of armor it seems like we're getting a little bit of armor uh, i'm not sure how long it goes up for let's wait a little bit here wow okay so literally one of them got me almost pretty much a little bit over halfway armor my vision's a little foggy but i'm not sure how long that lasts for but wow okay that's really good for just one that's that's actually really really good uh so let's grab this out and again i think we're gonna have to head to our oh wow everything is definitely a little blurry definitely a little disorientating i'm hoping this doesn't last too long but it is kind of cool that they have some sort of effect either way though i think we're gonna head over to my apartment because i want to grab out our weapon and do a bunch more chop shopping get a bunch more of those loose notes well i guess sell the parts get a bunch of those loose notes then and then figure out how to clean them all so uh let's go grab our gun 
from our apartment and uh i'll meet you guys once we've grabbed it and are hopefully gonna be able to start the chopping i'm gonna go grab my gun and uh probably just get us like a rental or something so i don't have to bring our bike somewhere and then i will see you guys once we are starting the chop shop job up once again Alrighty, so we have grabbed the chop shop list if we do slash chop shop we should be able to see it so we have a bf injector premiere exemplar f620 and a blade uh all these should be pretty easy i'm not too sure where to get the blade i think i might be able to get that maybe around innocence or somewhere around there i don't know we'll, we'll be able to find a blade somewhere eventually uh but the rest of them seem pretty easy i will probably start off with the bf injection since i'm pretty sure we can find those up here um, but I'm honestly probably going to do every single chop it's given us in this list. Because when I did it last time, it seemed like whenever we did one, it disappeared. So maybe we get something for doing all five of them. Or maybe we can just do like five a day or something like that. Either way, though, uh, I'm going to probably chop all of these vehicles on the list. And then I will uh, see you guys after. Hopefully, everything goes well. So, we are done shopping for now. Now, there was one car that I couldn't get, and the only car I couldn't get was the Blade, but it's been about a little over two hours. The server restart is also happening soon, and again, I just spent probably the last 20 minutes looking for this car everywhere and just could not find it. So, unfortunately, uh, I don't think we're going to be getting that one, but we got the other four, and we got quite a lot of stuff from it as well. Now, I have been putting everything pretty much... Ooh, free stuff. Easy. But I have been putting pretty much everything into our apartment just because it was close by and i was able to of course you know just chop the car and just head over to the apartment drop the stuff off and then continue on and that's what i've been pretty much doing again for the past couple hours so if we head back over to our apartment uh and we'll show you guys what we got in total from uh chopping again i believe four vehicles so if we head up again to our old apartment up here and we come over to the storage bin we can see what we have in total so we got a uh, quite a bit of stuff again i was told that mostly the expensive wheel the gps like all this stuff is the stuff that we can sell directly to them i'm guessing we can sell some of this other stuff as well uh we also got crypto usb sticks which i was told something about but i don't really remember what uh wait can we use these for anything no we can't uh, i remember they're used for something is on your phone let me see i could have sworn there was like a crypto app but maybe not yeah so i am not really sure oh wait maybe what's on the tablet let's see the tablet uh crypto okay nothing still nothing happens when we click on it uh we're not gonna get into the boost again just yet we don't have the tools for it or the knowledge but yeah i'm not sure what these crypto usb sticks are used for i was told something about them a while ago if i'm being honest i completely forget we also now have up to 80 loose notes and they're starting to degrade a little bit so we're gonna have to figure out how to run these as well but for now what we're gonna do is actually before we do any of this running i think we're gonna go 
back and grab our bike so we can do it on our bike which is a little bit safer plus we actually own the vehicle so we probably won't into, run into any issues with the cops so let me see where my vehicle actually is at all right it's a garage oh so i'm gonna go pick that up real fast and i'll catch up with you guys uh come back here grab all the stuff and then of course head up sell it all and see what we get i'll see you guys again in just a little bit once we've got our gargoyle picking up the stuff and heading over there and we're finally up here now on the way over i did get run over pretty harshly uh thankfully they gave me some nice little uh pikachu bandages unfortunately i used them all so i can't show you guys and a nice phoenix joint but we're gonna sell all this stuff off so we have quite a bit let's uh i could have sworn i heard someone running up okay just a little paranoid let's hit e and see what we get so there we go and we got a total of 52 more loose notes i think we have like 80 or something back at home uh either way let's go back home and deposit these notes and see what we have for a total and then probably we can try and figure out how to actually wash them hopefully it won't be too hard either way i will see you guys once we're back at the apartment dropping all this stuff off and seeing how many loose notes we're up to in total I'm finding more and more true. Okay, we got some nice music in the lobby. It's always nice. I'd give him some cash, but I don't know how to. Does it just slash give cash? Yeah, okay. I don't want to try and give the man money and then have it be awkward because we don't know how to pay him. But let's check a look at our stash. And we are up to 132 loose notes. So I think next is we finally figure out how to wash them. Uh, before we do that, though, I do want to go. Uh, I'm going to probably go fix myself up. Yep, I, yeah, I need to go to MD real bad. I'm going to go fix myself up. And then I will meet you guys once we're over at a mechanic garage. And uh, see how much it's going to cost to get repairs on our bike. It's going to be good for our future knowledge as well. Just so if we get into crashes, we're going to know how much like repair kits and such cost. Either way, though, let's go grab the gargoyle. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna go get my fix. I'm gonna go get myself fixed up at Pillbox. I'll meet you guys when we're at a mechanic shop, hopefully, figuring out some prices. Five minutes later. All right, it's gonna be a little bit harder to get this thing fixed now. Oh boy. Um, so I'm really not sure what to do. I would call tow, but the storm is literally, as you can see, almost about to be here in five or ten minutes. So I'm not sure what to do. I guess we'll just wait till after tsunami. Oh my gosh. And then I'll see you guys. This thing is... I might have to just tow it from the garage. I guess we'll see either way in just a little bit. Alrighty. So we are back. It is actually the next day. I also forgot uh, to replant those plants last night. Not my best, but uh, this one should be good to harvest now. There we go. And then I believe we should be able to add some care to this one now so we can add another water bottle and then it should be good oh wow this one takes a lot longer okay so the pineapple takes way longer than the uh the other strains i guess this one's grow quicker because probably they're cheaper uh but for now let's just put away their other phoenix flowers we got it doesn't seem like they degrade or if they do it's very very slow so not much to worry about there and we'll put those away for now we'll put the beretta away for now as well and what i think we're going to do is try and figure out how the heck we get our bike fixed so again yesterday unfortunately uh we actually ended up ending it after my bike completely totaled uh, well i got i kind of ran into a car and then it got totaled but you know we don't have to mention that part so i have no idea how we get our car back now that's completely wrecked let's see we go into our vehicle gargoyle okay unable to locate vehicle so let me see on the phone now that we know uh, so it is at Public Garage O, which I believe for some reason is all the way up in Polito. I'm guessing because that's where we last maybe put the bike away. That's a freaking long ways away though. All right, well, I'm going to head up to Polito and then I will guess we'll grab our bike, although I'm pretty sure the bike's going to be totaled, so I'm not sure what we're going to do about it. Either way, I'll meet you guys once we're up there. And we're over by the garage. Let's see what the situation is like. Oh, all right. Wait, are we fine? Oh, I think we're gonna be fine. Okay. Uh, okay, the engine, I think. No, the engine looks fine. Okay. Uh, either way, though, I did want to go to a repair shop or a mechanic shop and see how much repair kits are. Yeah, I'm not sure why it's fine, but uh, yeah, I'm not gonna complain. I also saw there's a race going on up here. 
So again, I'm not sure how we even join the races and obviously we don't have anything we can race with, but I've been seeing races literally all over the city and I, I just want to get into the freaking racing so bad. It's like the one thing that we're semi decent at. So I'd love to get into the racing here, but unfortunately, again, we don't really have a car with it for it. Uh, we might try just talking to them at some point and getting some info, but I don't want to disturb them too much. Either way, though, I'm going to fill up this bike. We're going to head over, find an open mechanic shop and uh, see how much it's going to cost us to get repair kits or just any general maintenance on the vehicle. I'll see you guys in just a little bit. All right. So Auto Exotic is the first shop I figured I'd check out. So, let's head on in and see how much repair kits are going to be costing us. Hey, oh. Hey, man. Uh, how much are repair kits? Yeah, Alright, alright. Um, uh, can I grab three of those if you don't mind? Uh, Chase, can you fill me? It's going to be 1,050. Perfect. If you get cash, or do you want to... Uh, bank would be perfect. Okay, perfect. 1,050. Uh, repair kits uh, truck and man. transfer. Perfect. Thank you. I think you arrested me. I arrested Perfect. There we go. We got three advanced repair kits. All right, sweet. So repair kits only 350. That's I thought they were going to be like a thousand each or something like that. 350 is not bad at all. Now we have three of them in case we crash our bike as we usually do. Um, but I think honestly that will be about it for this episode. I wanted to get the cash washed, but we're gonna probably figure that out and do that in the next episode. I might look around and see if I can figure it out as well. Uh, actually, wait quickly before we do end this episode though, I'm gonna go pick up some fertilizer and then I will meet you guys once we're back at the apartment. We're gonna plant the rest of our plants real quick and then I think we're gonna end it. So uh, let me just pick up this fertilizer real fast. If there's anyone working and there's our bill. Hey, perfect. Let's grab our awesome. stuff real fast. All right, my guy, there is your 10 fertilizer. You have a wonderful day and stay perfect. high. Thank you very much, my man. You as well. Take care. Yeah, thank you. All right, perfect. Grab the fertilizer. Let's head back to the apartment, plant the rest of our plants, and then uh, probably be ending it there. I'll meet you guys once we're back home. And we are back home. Uh, I think we should have plenty of water for this. Oh, six water. Yeah, that should be enough. We're going to have to buy some more for the secondary plants, but we have another three Phoenix seeds and two of these dumpster OG seeds, which I'm not sure if the dumpster is even good because, again, pretty sure you just get it from dumpster diving. Uh, any update on this little guy? No, still 34%. So, yeah, the, I'm guessing the higher quality takes a lot longer. So, first of all, we're going to do three Phoenix seeds and then the three or the two of the OG dumpster. Let me plant them all real fast. and that should be all the plants now start treating them of course from the back here so the way i organized it is these three are going to be the phoenix ones so let's quickly water and fertilize each one of them fertilizer water and then once we're done with this last one these last two are the dumpsters so now we have them a little organized we have our nice one behind us and then we have the three mid tiers there and then the two low tiers over here so i got them all decently organized at least in a way that i'll remember them so there we go they all should be good and ready to go let's just double check yeah they're all good yeah that one's already at 74 so these ones are already at 74 after just yeah 60 74 okay so all those are pretty high up just after one treatment and then how much are the dumpster okay they're about halfway and this one is about a little over halfway and then we got our pineapple our good one over here and that one seems like it's still going to take a little bit longer but i think that's going to be about it um before the next episode i'll obviously keep taking care of these plants and hopefully they're ready to harvest by the next one but i think that's going to be about it for now we actually did quite a bit today and i hope you guys did enjoy it and if you guys enjoyed the video, as always, make sure to leave a like. And if you want to, subscribe. And I will see you in the next video.